No chill, no filter. What's poppin', what's poppin', and what is poppin' again? We got Lady Loyalty in the house, you know what I mean? Y'all already see what's going on, man. I felt that I did not want to be on camera today. <laughs> I'm getting old and ugly, so I need younger faces, which is cool. And what are we talking about today? We are talking about what, Lady Loyalty? No Love Lost Volume 1 Prediction. League of Extraordinary Writers. The low... Somebody said low key. It is low key. Low oh yeah, key it do say that. League. Yeah, you know what? That is crazy because I am just seeing the the actual. I'm sorry, I'm just seeing the actual analogy on that. L O E W, mm -hmm. League of Extraordinary Writers mm -hmm. with the key. Yeah, Battle League. Okay, okay. No love lost. Volume one. All right, we just gonna jump right into this. First off, man, happy. Uh, what, what you want to call it? Um, Black History Month. All day. I say black history life. You know what I'm saying? Happy black history life. Mm -hmm. We're supposed to be pretty much celebrating black history every day. You know every what day, I mean? all because, day. You know what I mean? We, we, we went through a whole lot. Well, not we, because, I mean, I ain't never been hit with no whip. So, <laughs> this is not funny. I, 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 well, you know, you can laugh about it. We can laugh about it now. I'm talking about we, your ass. <laughs> I ain't never been hit with no whip. Yeah, because, you know, you swat me with one of those. Well, we're going to go ahead and jump right into this. All right? All right, we're going to start from the undercard, man. Bobo versus Scotty Lyrical. Well, this is... Okay, so Bobo, I didn't see him maybe two, three times. He's never prepared. Mm. Um, Scotty, barely prepared. Mm. Um, so it's just basically going to go off of who remembers their shit and who get through it fluently. Right. So I ain't even, even going to call that. Yeah, yeah, I would say something about that myself, but go ahead, be input. Actually, Bobo come be coming here with uh, uh, Ill and them, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, I guess yeah, I can pretty much say the same thing. You know, if Bobo prepare, he'll be okay. Right. All right, Big Tay is jumping back in the ring what? versus DP. <laughs> okay, I'm old liking school. that. Old yeah, school. I'm liking that. Um, DP, what you say? I really don't. I think I probably seen him maybe like once. Yeah. I only seen him like maybe once and he was okay with the shit that he got off. Um Big Tay, you know, he yeah. he an OG in the game, but you know, Big Tay he be fucking up too. Yeah. I'ma just keep it one hundred. So yeah. um I don't know. I just really don't know. It's just gonna be old school versus newer old school. Right. Because I don't know how old DP is, but I don't think he that young. <laughs> right. But I mean, you know, comparing bar for bar, I would have Big Tay over the, over DP. Yeah, because Big Tay gonna talk that that gangster shit, that straight yeah. street shit, and that's yeah. what I like. That's hitting my soul. Exactly. Exactly. You know, as long as he don't, you know, hit that roadblock and right. You know how that go. Okay, I got Big Tay. You got Big Tay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Rich Porter versus Young L.A. Well, I'm going with J. Blow now, which is Rich okay. Porter. Um, I'm going to go with J. Blow. Uh, Young L.A. Um, yeah, he, you know, he done been on World Star a couple times. Now he an activist. Shout out to him. But um, Been on World Star for what? Oh, uh, whooping somebody ass a couple times. Oh, that's uh, what they was talking about when yeah. they was rapping that about. Okay. Yeah, right. he been on there a couple of times with uh -huh. somebody else a couple of times. Okay. But uh, that's his past. He activist now. Mm -hmm. He all for the you know for the peoples. Right. Um, but I'm gonna go with Jay Blow because bar wise, Jay he Rich Porter got it. I'm sorry. Okay. STP versus Young Ruffin. If STP show the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah Are you gonna show up? Also, because STP was supposed to be scheduled for the 2020 mm -hmm. Vision event. Yep. And did not make it. Yeah, he never shows up. And Young Ruffin, he fresh. Yeah. You know, literally fresh, fresh out. Uh, um, but, um, STP did elevate. Um, but I can't even give it to him because he ain't been showing up. Right. So, I'm going to go with Young Ruffin. His last battle here was with, uh, Scotty Lyrical, wasn't it? What? The last one he showed up for, I think. Oh, no, no. I think his last battle was uh, STP. Was it a... Uh, uh, it was OG. Was it a uh, Herb? Was it? He yeah. Oh, yeah. When they jumped him. Tried to jump him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that didn't work out. The, right. That was actually <laughs> the battle. Yeah, yeah. You know, <coughs> Urban Legend ain't no chump. Right. Now, that was Urban Legend that he battled. Mm, right? I think okay. so. If I'm not making no mistake, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that's what it was. Um, yeah, as a matter of fact, I'm pretty sure it was. And, uh, okay, yeah, that was him versus Urban Legend. That was actually on Jack City Battle League. Right. Right. Okay, Buck versus Buck. Oh, 
Maserati versus Uptown. I'm going with old school Uncle yeah, Buck. Yeah, Uptown. Maserati just, he don't move me. <laughs> I'm sorry. Your name is a car that moves everyone really yeah. fast and not just really. I'm going with old school Buck. I want to know if they fighting over the name, if they're if they going to be battling over this name. Oh, well, Maserati might as well change his shit. <laughs> 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 well, you know, Buck's supposed to have battle at this last one, but I guess something had came up and he couldn't do it. So okay. I'm wondering, you know, we got like two weeks left. You know, I mean, a lot can happen in a couple right. weeks. So we're going to have to see what happens with that. All right. All right, Buck versus Buck, we got Uptown. Cool. Slap Squad. This next one. G Face yes. versus P. Jesus. So, did anybody Ooh. get a welcome home thing? Because I didn't even know G-Face was out. I really? Some, yeah, I did I talked to him on the phone. Oh, I was yeah. like one of the first people he talked to when he came when he got home. Oh, okay. Well, so, um, Yeah, home. he knows everything that's been going on oh. since he got locked up. So, oh, this is okay. going to be very interesting. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I, I want to, I kind of like want to be in the house. Definitely. Well, I will be in the house because I'll be. I'm most definitely going to be there. I'm not on none of that. I'm not missing it. Just because yeah. his face is there. Yeah. I have to be there because I want to see if everyone's going to keep the same energy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that'll, that's definitely, definitely something that's going to remain mm -hmm. to be seen. Yeah. So. Now, how I'm going to call it. Man, look, let me tell you something. G-Face was cold before the whole little incident. Mm -hmm. Accusations, that's what we're going to call him because he was found not guilty. He wasn't convicted. So, right. um, P-Jesus, he never delivers. He's been battling for shit almost long as I've been around battle rapping this motherfucker. And right. he just really never, never delivers. So, I'm going to go with G-Face. Oh, man. Okay. Well... Actually, I can say the same. Um, but sometimes, you know, P. Jesus can show up and show out a little bit. Indeed. Yeah, but I guess in this one here, you know, you gotta... The last P. Jesus battle I seen, I think that was when Shadow made his debut. Oh, oh, hey, and fuck Jesus, I'm an atheist. He'll get a Holy Spirit if I aim. And he'll shake with some high in him. And hollow be that name. Was it? Yeah, that was the last one I actually watched of his. Okay. And, um, yeah, he dropped the ball. And, uh, yeah, Shadow did his thing. So, mm. um. Okay. Yeah. Well, on to the main event. We got Tom Montana versus Ella. Oh, my God. Tom Montana. Yeah. He my back. brother. Yeah, he back. He back. <laughs> my okay. brother. One okay. of the first. Wait, he was the first person from Wisconsin to get on Smack. Was, was he? he? Yeah. Mm, okay. Yeah, to get on Smack main stage on URL. Oh, if okay. I'm not mistaken, yeah, Tom Montana was the first one. So, um, okay, gonna have to drop that link. Yeah, I will. Did it I'm drop? It dropped? Yeah, it did. Okay, okay, okay. Um, he only, you know, he ain't gonna, he had like one classic ass round, if I'm not mistaken. It was a three rounder? Yeah, I think it was a three round. It was him versus a uh, lot of Zay. A lot of, okay. I mean, he'd been there on a couple of times, but that was his first one. Okay. And, um, yeah, he had a classic ass round about the guns. That shit did just always go down in history. Right, right. But, um, mm -hmm. Illa, yeah. Illa's nice. I'm not taking nothing away from him. He will bark. Yes, he will. And if tone comes like the tone I know yeah. can come, then I'm going to have to side with tone. But if he slacks any little bit of a way, Illa's going to take it. So you think he slacked against Mike G last year um, on Jack City Battle League? I wouldn't say he slacked. I just say I say he, he didn't write up to his... His, capabilities okay. like he wasn't i don't know if he didn't take mike g serious which i don't understand right but um he wasn't the tone that i needed him to be to yeah. be tone to be a uh, mike i didn't yeah. he, he wasn't there because because mike came on 100 oh uh, yeah always <laughs> mike, that, in real life that he's a different gorilla yeah yeah for <laughs> real let him gang in the house mm -hmm. okay man ll cool you already know versus young cannon this is gonna be so cold it's gonna be epic because right? i love cool mm -hmm. And I love Young Kenny. Right. So this is going to be a fucking classic. I already know that Coogee going to come with his shit only because Coogee has never dropped the ball. Right. I don't care how many fucking battles he's preparing for. It could be 5, 10, 1. He always come prepared. He always remember his shit. He deliver his shit fluently. Mm hmm Young Kenny, he had a couple, you know, that he didn't, you know, show up for. But seeing as if, uh, I think he going to take Coogee serious. 
He better. I think he's gonna take Hoogie serious. He so, <laughs> so um, it's gonna be a battle to the finish. But if I had to say who I'm gonna give it to, Corbell punches. I yeah. just, I just I do he punches. I need yeah. that. I need you that. You know what? Koji did me a favor and slowed it down a little bit. Yeah. Now he got that element where you know what anybody he go up against because you remember he he used to rapping on beats. Mm-hmm. So that's what it's kind of like seemed like it seemed like he tongue twisted. Right, right, right. So now that he done slowed it down a little bit, right. he done slowed it down for mm -hmm. those who don't think so fast. Like, right. oh, gee. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, you know, I'm like, okay. The you know, ones that process a little slow. Yeah, you know I mean, so, you know, I'm like, because, you know, I'm laid back. You know, right. I like to, you know, I don't want to be up there having to do all the extra work. You know, right. just, you know, spoon feed me a little bit every now and again. Right. His last battle, we yeah, he did slow it down. So, yeah, yeah, I mean, his last few, um... The last <clears throat> battle, not not just oh yeah, and on one. his PGs too. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, he definitely, he definitely got it. He got it cracking. Now, yeah, so, so I'm gonna side with with Kooji on of that course. one. Of course, what you mean? So okay, now, now we got two OTs. We got Stewie Newton and we got Briggs Belvey. Briggs Belvey's supposed to have showed up to the last event. Indeed, 2020 Vision supposed to battle King Kamazi. True. He didn't show up. Uh, I don't know. What the I know why he was. didn't, but we're not going to talk about it on this camera. Oh, yes. Okay. So, um, uh, filter TV, <laughs> right? Filter TV. <laughs> um, Stewie, I love Stewie. Yeah. The Stewie that has the Stewie has been come become it is awesome. Mm -hmm. Keep doing what the hell you doing, my brother. I just really love it. Bricks, he's gonna bark. He's gonna do everything that he needs to do. But Stewie, yeah, I got Stewie. Yeah, I think Stewie just got a little bit much more, too much energy for him. Yeah, he got that little oomph. Yeah, he got he got a little bit more energy. But I mean, don't get it twisted though. Bricks is not going to get pushed around. No, he's not. Because because Bricks can bark also. Bridge is totally not saying that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bricks, Bricks can bark also, but I think Stewie Bar Wise probably gonna get at him. Indeed. So we got live performances. BHG bosses having goals. Ashanti, not the one that you're thinking of. Um, 54 Baby Trey, BHG Action, and Chosen Kid. Let, don't ask me nothing about none of these people. Okay. Because I don't know them. Okay. Um, it's going to be music there. You know what I mean? The DJ OG Gotti. My man's going to be in the house at the Tycoon Lounge. Um, actually, where is this place? Uh, the old um, 16th and National. 16th and National? Yeah, the old, uh, uh, what's the face? Okay, the, the, I can't even think of it. Uh, what the fuck was it called? You know what I talked about. No, I wasn't. I was finna say the looks. It was, um. Uh, what the fuck was that? International? When they called International at first? Club International. And it meant like three. Yeah, was it Club International? Yeah, it was like three. It was Club International at first. Where you go in and you can buy the booth? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. And then they got okay. the little upstairs up there. Yeah. Right, right, mm -hmm. right. Yeah. Okay, okay. That's a pretty decent place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a nice little spot. Okay, what the hell? I can't even see the address. Can you? Shit. The address is blurry. Where is the address? Is the address on there? At Tycoon. Right it just there. say at Tycoon, but that just say uh, Sports Bar and Grill. Oh, well. So we need to get an address on that, maybe. Yeah, uh, yeah. Everybody doesn't know where it's located. Right. Might have to put it in the description. I'll be giving giving Shadow a hit. Speaking of Shadow, you know what I mean? Shout out to the man. Um, First card. Yeah. Let's yeah. see how it's going to go. Hey, everybody Proud of show you. up. Yeah, most Proud definitely. Of you. You know what I mean? Shout out to all the cats, man, that's actually going to be on this card also. Indeed. This is, this is definitely a fire card. Yeah, I like you know it. I mean? uh, the main event is definitely going to be off the hook. Indeed. Okay. Well, I mean, say what you got to say and then you can sign off this bitch. Well, shit, hell. I just hope everybody show up, show the fuck out, leave the drama at home, um, which is, you know, here nor there. Right. Uh, but... I'm coming in. I'm want to hear. I want to hear bars. I want to hear metaphors. I want to hear punches. I want to hear that street shit. I want to hear everything. I want to hear just a whole lot of fluent motherfuckers be coming prepared. Can we get all the battlers prepared, please? And here for the one time. And here, <laughs> yes. STP, yes. DP. I ain't gonna say Illa. Illa, Illa show up. Even uh, yeah. there ain't no battle all day. So, yeah, Illa be here all day. So I just want to see everybody have a good time. This is first card. Mm -hmm. I'm geeked about it. Mm -hmm. uh, much love to the brother For sure. And um Shit hell that's it And this is your girl Lady Loyalty And we out this bitch Peace No chill no filter <laughs> Hey baby <laughs>